You ever wonder how dangerous your eBay K40 laser can be? Hopefully that answers the question. What am I talking about? Let's jump into this together and I'll explain. Welcome to this episode of DIY3DTech.com. In this episode, I want to share this with you. Yes, folks, that is how dangerous your eBay K40 laser can be. When your laser tube develops a short and arcs to your chassis. This is what we're talking about here, and this is what I've covered in other episodes. You have 25,000 volts jumping to ground, and this is why you need a good ground, because that can happen. If this didn't have a good ground to go to, I would be having a problem, because that would probably be running through my body. So, again... So, those out there who are considering buying an eBay K40 laser, be prepared. This is a high voltage device. There's 20 to 25,000 volts going through there. Now, yes, it's low amperage, but do you want to see this one again? No, that's not Frankenstein. That's, again, an eBay K40 laser. So again, I don't mean to scare you guys, but uh, again, I was working on this. It, uh, for some reason, developed a short. I don't know quite what happened here, but the tube is no longer lasering, so I have a problem. And all that power has to go somewhere, and this, again, is why you need a good ground on this unit. So hopefully you found this interesting. If you did... There's another shocking experience for you. So with that, hopefully you learned a little bit of a lesson on this. And again, you really need to respect these things. These things can be very dangerous all the way from the laser output of this tube to that high voltage stuff going awry. So with that, hopefully you found this enlightening or at least electrifying, one or the other. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. Also, Swag Shop's in the corner. Subscribe down below, and we'll catch you in the next video where we do something else shocking. Cheers. Please click like below and subscribe to the channel to keep up to date on all of our projects.